Oh, hey there, YouTube. I didn't see you there. This is Showman1 here, bringing you some more Black Ops gameplay right now. Alright, um, anyway, today I'm going to be talking about, um, just like pretty much one topic, which I don't usually do. Um, I find that most of my commentaries are sort of like free ball. It just start out, I mean, I usually have like a general topic in my head, um, when I'm starting, but what I usually do is I just kind of like take the gameplay, upload it onto my iMovie software stuff, and then I get a little bit of a topic in my head and then just wing it from there. Um, it usually turns out pretty well, but you know, I kind of decided that I'm going to have to start coming up with general topics um, to actually, you know, effectively make commentaries. So today I'm going to be talking about jobs which is something that plagues people my age and it's plagued people my age for decades, uh, generations, whatever. Um, at my age I'm 14 years old, almost 15. Uh, I'm going to be 15 in less than a month. So happy birthday to me. Anyway, um, so I do have a job. Um, I have a great job. I ref soccer. Um, a lot of people think, oh, it's such a gay sport to be involved with. Well, soccer at the travel level is amazing. You see kids uh, slide tackling into each other, breaking each other's legs. It's intense. It's awesome. I love it. <laughs> I mean, soccer is just a fun sport all around. I, it's really fun to watch, really fun to play, especially to play. Um, anyway, I ref soccer. I've been refing soccer. I believe this is my third year going into it. Um, I finally get a different colored shirt rather than a yellow shirt which is what you start out with for the first two years of your career but um yeah and so I started out with rec soccer um, which is just you know the regular in town um, not travel so you know it's just for the regular average Joes get to play whatever started refing that made a decent amount of money fifteen dollars a game which is about fifteen dollars an hour <clears throat> And uh, that's about twice minimum wage. It, oh, almost twice minimum wage. I think it's about eight dollars or something like that. So um, that wasn't bad. And I can get. I used to get up to like seven games in a week, uh, but that was only on a good week. But um, and then I eventually moved up in to travel soccer for my second year of refing soccer. Um, that was kind of hard to do. I mean, you get you take a lot more ridicule. And um, it's sort of hard to take that unless you're kind of prepared for it, which they don't teach you in the classes. They don't teach you how to really take the ridicule. They, they teach you how to counter it, how to kind of like, um, like they teach you what to do. Like you can't talk back to the coaches or the spectators. Uh, you can card them or whatever, you know, make them shut up, but you can't really say anything to them. So it kind of makes your life a little bit harder as a soccer ref because you don't know what you're doing going in there. You only know the rules, but you don't know the whole social aspect of it. So, uh, once I moved up, uh, uh, once I moved up to travel, uh, my pay doubled. So well, more than doubled. I went from fifteen dollars a game up to thirty-two dollars a game. Um, same age group, um, and it opened up a lot more opportunities. Like I was doing, um, I was refing games with people who were only a year younger than me, yet taller than me, since I'm only about five foot six and a half at most, maybe five foot seven, I don't even think so. And so they were like some of these kids were like five ten up to six feet and they were in eighth grade, which is insane. Um yeah, and so I got to do that. I made forty five dollars for that game, which was awesome, in about an hour and a half. So uh I started making a lot more money, which is amazing. And it's I, I kinda feel bad for the other kids my age since they're only making um they're mowing lawns pretty much, um, doing maybe one lawn per week, maybe two lawns per week, maybe about 30 bucks per lawn. They think that that's good, but, and uh, I mean, it's better than having nothing, but what's that really going to get you? With my job, I was able to buy myself this MacBook Pro that I'm using, uh, which I edit all myself, I edit all my videos on, I record videos on, um, I do all that stuff on it, it's, it's awesome, and I was only able to do that because of this money that I'm making from roughing soccer. 
and I was also able to buy my HD PVR and my Triton headset uh, AX720s, which are amazing. Um, yeah, but it, it's kind of sad that other kids are forced to work um, on Friday nights from like uh, 4 o'clock to like 11 o'clock at night at like video stores and stuff or like on Saturdays from like 10 in the morning to 10 at night. It, it's just sad that they have to do that. And for minimum wage, sometimes less, um, since a lot of them are minors and um, it's not required that they be paid minimum wage. <laughs> Ugh, God, got a little stuffy nose right now. Uh, anyway, um, but when I when I get older, I definitely want to be something like a lawyer, I guess, either a lawyer or an engineer. I know there's two different fields, but Three well, completely different fields. Lawyer because I'm amazing at negotiating, amazing at creating arguments. I mean, you know, like <laughs> in class or something, I'm amazing at like creating an argument and winning it. But engineering, I'm also amazing at science and math. Um, as I mentioned in my last video, I'm in um, junior level math honors, so I'm in honors algebra two, and I took algebra and geometry in my eighth grade year. So. You know, I'm amazing at math and science and all that stuff, and um, I definitely want to do something with that. I know engineering can make a lot of money right out of college, which is great. So, um, you know, that's pretty cool. Um, tell me in the comment section below, uh, what do you guys want to do uh, for a job? Or if so, if you already have a job, what do you do? And um, also, what did you do as a kid if you're an adult now? Um, yeah, so just tell me that in the comment section below. But, um... Yeah, so I definitely want to try to make some money right out of college, which will make life a lot easier for me and my family. I can just move right out, and I don't have to stay at home after college for like three or four years like a lot of people do. But um, this will bring us to the end of the video. I'm not sure um, how much gameplay I have left because I'm not looking at it right now. But um, yeah, I'm just going to go ahead and cut it off in a second. So uh, yeah, just tell me in the comment section below um, all that stuff. And I uh, hope you guys enjoyed this video. Uh, it's just Shulman1. And, uh, you know, peace.